All right. Welcome back. We are continuing with Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition, so the original Baldur's Gate. Uh, we've just dealt with the Seven Suns Trading Coaster, which was taken over by a bunch of doppelgangers. Sorted. So I guess our next thing, we need to go find the Flaming Fist and... Oh, we got a level up, so let's do our level up. He is now a sixth level thief. Let's get his open locks capped. And put some into hide in shadows. sure what that building is, but that door doesn't exist. General store. I'm on it. Okay. There's the storekeeper. Oh, come on, guys. Welcome to my humble establishment. Uh. Okay. And attention, what do you have to show me? <laughs> well, at least he does have axes, starts. Uh. Should probably get some more bullets for her. Um. So her inventory is full, as usual. I'm on it. So what is this? Rising, right? Cleveland. Still can't. I'm on it. Right, what's this then? I'm on it. Definitely I'm one on of it. the more interesting things to happen. Let's see if there's anything in here. 33 gold. Okay. Well, let's look around. Oh, there's a fountain. train tracks that just randomly run through the city. You there! Identify 
So pleasant to see your face once again. Don't you recognize me? It is I, Aldous Sashenstar. I am so glad to have met you, especially at a time like this. I need to speak with you privately. Will you listen to what I have to say? Of course we'll listen. What is it you have to say? Thank you so much, my friends. This should suffice for privacy. I'm sorry for all this hiding and skulking, but there are dire events afoot. You know that I am one of the principal shareholders of the Merchants League. Well, I share ownership of the company with two others. Erlentry and Zorro Meyer, two very distinguished gentlemen. When I returned from my hunting trip, thanks to you, I might add, I found that my two partners had undergone some profound changes. Nothing physical or overt, but something more sin sinister. Well, go on. What's so sinister? It's as if my partners had become wholly different people while I was gone. They almost take an active interest in squandering our company's resources on frivolous and stupid ideas. If they continue on this course, the company will be in shambles in but a few weeks. I know you have already helped me once, but I ask for your assistance again. I have no other recourses. Come into the Merchants League estate with me. I will explain that you are old friends of mine and will quarter all of you in, my in the guest chambers. From there, please investigate my partners, perhaps using magic or any other skills you possess. Learn as much as you can during your visit and then report back to me after you're done. It should only take a couple of days. Days, Danes. All right. Uh, just follow me into the Merchants League estate. You may begin the investigation as soon as you get inside. I shall be waiting for any reports of your progress on the second floor. Sorted. Mm. Generic response. That's fine. Walling to bed, we get a generic response I from him. Anything I can help you me. with? Oh, yes, yours, those friends of Aldeth. Love to get to know you better, but I'm awfully busy. Yeah, I'm sure you're awfully busy. I don't like no snot nose brats got a yeah. Go open um what? I've got the best Merchant. prices this side of Cormier. Merchant bartender. Well, let's talk to the bartender, see if he's got something different you to want say. The whiskey. I don't recognize you. Are you new to the Merchants League? Well, it matters little. I don't have anything to drink. My masters haven't ordered any new booze to replace our last stock. Kind of thoughtless of them, but then they've been acting a little weird for a while now. Yes, as you wish. You're a queer fellow. I'm gone. Locked. Why on earth would it be locked? Ashlak. As long as Alden lives, he is a great threat to all of us. He is friends with the mercenaries who have been stirring up so much trouble in the south. 
if he were to confide his fears with them, it could be disastrous. Kill him soon, your friend. Okay. Okay, we'll grab that one. Shalak, I'm glad to hear that you were successful in disposing of Zorl. With his identity, you should be able to infiltrate more of your kindred into Merchant's League. Kill Erlen Tree as soon as possible, and then that fop, Aldrith. Okay, grab that one. Shalak, it pleases to me to know that you now count Erlen Tree among your number. But you must kill Aldith's Sashin Star. He is a foppish dilettant with no skill and little intellect. It confuses me that you have not killed him yet. Have your skills withered right back soon when you have killed the Aldith. Your friend. Okay. Yes, wherever fate takes me. Spit it out. Right, what's this then? Okay. Well. I'm on it. It's like a giant banquet hall. Oh, uh, there's stuff there. Uh, we don't really have any spare room to see what's there, but we'll look. Okay. Back downstairs. I think we got all the evidence. Right, we what's this then? My honor is my life. As you will. What is your bidding? Great peril yields great beauty. What you want? I've done had enough Hi. of it. Hi! Sure thing. What is it? Consider it done. You rang. Sorted. Well. Yep. Can honestly, do. you should be over there. Go on, then. Right, what's this, then? Manners, brute. How have things been faring? Have you learned anything? Well, we found some documents that you might find very interesting. First Elven, and now this. We must tread very carefully, for these documents bear truth. For if these documents bear truth, then we are potentially in a very dangerous situation. Rumor has it that my anniversary is this very day. It isn't. Perhaps we can use it to get to the bottom of this. Shall we meet upstairs in a bit? You uh, go ahead, and I'll be right behind. I need to consult with Brandalar. What is going on here that deserves such an audience? Explain yourself, Ir Ir Irland Tree. Why spread false rumors about my anniversary when you know perfectly well that this is not the day. Are you sure, Aldith? I was almost certain that this was the day. Perhaps, Aldith, your memory has become somewhat addled. You seem to be forgetting and even inventing elements of your past. Take, for example, your childhood friends. A most stupid lie, meat. Come now, Zoro, we mustn't be so rude. These primates are about to take the final step to become something much greater than what, they, than what they were. Before you die, primates, I have been instructed to give you a message from our employer, Raltar. He wishes you to know how much fun it's been matching wits with you. So the documents speak the truth. You foul creatures will answer for what you've done. Brandalar, arrest these fools. That's a lot of doppelgangers in all honesty.
<laughs> that is a lot of doppelgangers. Sorted. Learn some manners, Those monsters still live. Put an end to them. Well, they're not on this floor. What do you need? Still more doppelgangers. We won't be safe until till you've killed them all. <laughs> right, what's this then? Let's see. Cook. What? Not a doppelganger. I've got the best prizes this side of Cormier. What's this then? I've got the best prizes this side of Cormier. Hmm. Don't want to just start swinging my sword violently and viciously right, at everything and anything. I'm on it. I mean, that, that was a lot of guns. Mammoth. Monster. A lot of doppelgangers. Okay. Salty. For the glory of Helm! Yes! I cannot give my approval for what you just did. Okay. <laughs> Despise reputation. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Sorted. Whoops. <laughs> okay. Hundred and get his hiding shadows up so he can do stuff. And okay. Uh well we'll try and go just straight there. <laughs> get this. Oh boy. I'm on it. Well, Windows is being stupid and decided to Salt. kill my camera again, so my image is just going to be frozen. Okay. She's huh, got a you're thing a this time. Oh. <laughs> Let's do this intelligently and quick save this I'm time. On it. Before we go running up here.
All right. Nothing is more vulgar than bad manners. Okay. Oh my gosh, Emma, get out of there. Uh, yes. You. Do something useful. You right. Yep. You yep, yep, yep. stop it. All right. Well, learn some manners. Those monsters still live. Put an end to them. I mean, oh, there's Get over here. one of them. Okay, I must thank you for saving my consortium. I will reward all of you greatly for what you have done for me. I hope what I give you now is reward enough. This sword is a family heirloom and could be useful if you ever were, if you were to run into those shape-shifting creatures again. Know that if you are in trouble, you can come to my estate. Sorted. Right, what's this then? Okay. So that's I'm done. On it. So that's another trading go. Sure that will stop losing money. Anything? Tavern and end. Store, general store. Hello. Your party is free of the taint of evil. Please pass unmolested. I'm on it. Complaints about the service? There's a well out wall out back that'll be glad to hear. Them. So, would you like a drink? Sure. Ah, uh, rumors. 
sorted. General store. Let's see. I'm on it. Welcome to my humble establishment. Uh, show me what you have. past a king named Regard was renowned for the spies he kept. So skillful were they that they that no nook or cranny escaped their eye, and maps were held for entire castles and towns. Eventually betrayed from within, the tools of their trade were taken and dispersed, ensuring that none could amass such a band again. Three versus shaved shears. First glance, the sword appears much like any other. In the presence of any shape-shifting creature, however, the blade becomes warm as its power stirs. Its namesake was the original owner of the weapon, and his tale, though mostly long forgotten, was wrought with treachery and deceit. Rumors persist that he paid a fearsome price for this blade, but with it he revealed the true identities of those that sought to betray him. Their names and crimes, however, are long since to long lost to history. Um, <laughs> oh, can you identify those bracers? Nope. Identify the wand. Can't identify, can't identify, can't identify. Oh, he can identify that. That's a plus one, but he can't identify the bolts. Uh, plus four versus crushing. Okay, not. Worth a lot. Hmm. All right, I guess we don't need it then because. You sure don't Salty. have anywhere near what we were looking for. Right, what's this then? Welcome to my humble establishment. Well, Peru the provided the gold enough, but have you anything worth buying? I mean, don't look like it. Oh, but you can identify a wand. So maybe you can identify these scrolls. But apparently not that. Curse scroll of force. Nice. Of course. Up. Oh. So AC seven. Okay. What are you wearing? Bracers to the death. AC6. So these are AC7. Yeah, she's wearing better right now. Oh, Dale's protector. Okay.
Why is there oil of fiery burning on the ground? <laughs> what is it? Wait, what? Spit it out. I pick that up, it's going to literally be like <gasps> Thieves! What? Flaming fist, okay. Mm -hmm. All right, let's clear out more of this. Lots of locked doors, but got a lot we need. We can Flaming Fist Castle. General stores, general stores. Okay. Yeah, I knew you saved the day. Sorted. I am a man of my word. I'm glad to see you have returned. So, what news do you bring me? Doppelgangers have taken over many of the higher echelons of the coaster. The monsters are all dead now, slain by us. You've slain some doppelgangers? Fantastic! I suppose Lola has already lectured you on the differences between sanctioned and rogue actions, eh? Well, you and I know these things can always go by the book. Did you come across Jasso is alive? Alive and well, Jasso is back in control of the business. I'm impressed. You're as good as your word, and obviously very deadly in your work. I'll give you the wage you deserve. Triple our original agreement. I want to keep in touch with you, especially if the Iron Throne is up to what you say it is. Have another job you might be interested in. You'll be well paid for your services. Care to hear more? We're always interested in more. What does it entail? Problem is this. Every night, people have been disappearing from the streets of the city. My men have been scouring the city trying to find the culprit, but so far to no avail. People have begun to get scared, and very few are willing to leave their homes at night. Something has to be done, and quickly. Would you be willing to take the job? Pay you 300 gold in advance with a 1,000 gold bonus if you discover what's happening with the disappearing citizens. What do you say? We agree. Your job is really simple. All I want you to do is patrol the east of the city and find an entrance to the sewers. Perhaps you'll get lucky and find out what's been happening. If you do find out what's been happening, come see me at the Flaming Fist Barracks. Our only clue so far has led us to the sewers, so if you want to explore them first, it would be a good idea. Also, we found tracks of some many-legged creature, perhaps a centipede-like monster. What do you need? What's your business here? Well, we're here to see Scar. I've been told to expect you. He's either just down the hall or outside the entrance. He's been waiting some time to talk to you. So you should speak with him soon. Fergus. Because <laughs> with a name like Fergus... Gotta admit, I ain't never been happier. Got a leather from my lady, and she's gonna be home real soon. Just gonna find me a pretty little ring for a pretty little finger, and all's gonna be just fine, just fine. But my lady, she transcends gold or silver or fancy stone. She'll have nothing less than an angel skin ring for me. And we 
go through so many of those rings in all honesty. Another angel skin ring. Okay. Sorted. Head to the east side. Okay, we're heading east. We'll be heading east. We'll get that direction eventually. I want my mommy. Okay. I lost my dolly. Meander, meander, meander. Come on, people. Got places to go. Monsters to kill. And random people to help. That doesn't get us. Okay. I'm on it. Anywhere, so. It's discount store. All right. Oh, here we are. Sewers. Now, let's remember to save before I go jumping into the sewers. So, some pure surface dwellers have come to their death. It'll just be extra treasure for my collection. My pets have been causing so much anguish in your sufferance realms, haven't they? They have been so useful at collecting the surface pinklings. My pets use the flesh for food. I get pretty treasure. Kill these intruders. Emelyn, what I'm are gone. you doing? What is your bidding? Hello. My blade will cut you down to size. My honor is my life. Stay on the him. Glory of Helm. I am in need of aid. I am in need of aid. I am in need of aid. Life is adventure. What's up? You ride. Get over 
Where did Imran die? You will. Do you need something? Of course. No, where did Imoen die? Oh, my word, of course. I'm on it. My honor is my right. Uh, whoops. Just what I need. I need you yes. to not kill her, please. Get over here. By helm. My honor with helms. What is it? Sleep well, my friend. <sighs> Very well. What's this then? <laughs> You're a queer fellow. Yes. Hi. Wow, everyone's getting paralyzed, huh? My honor is my life. Well. So, seventh level. Seventh level cleric. Yay. Helm's blessing. Okay. By Helm. Yeah. Slow, but okay. I think we found I'm on it. What was 
was ho killing people then. <laughs> maybe, just maybe, the Ogre Mage and all of those... Yeah. Uh, the Ogre Mage and the Carrying Crawlers. Yeah, that might have been the problem. Right, what's this then? Okay. You want the whiskey? Yeah, at least till you can pay your tab. Can I? Uh, yeah. Wouldn't mind a nice night's rent. Sorted. Didn't I talk to you? Hello, pal. Oh, yeah, I have. Okay. Sorted. Sorted. In all honesty, I think we want get back down in these sewers here because there might be a few more carrying crawlers wandering around sorted There's something there. What you want? I've done had enough of this. Not gonna be picking up corpses. Oh, yep. Okay. I've done had enough of this. Female body? Yep. Mm. Okay, uh, I think we, we know Go where on, this man. is going. Sorted. Uh, these are all the corpses. My honor is my life. Yeah! I care not. I've done had enough of this. Male, female, okay. Alright, so. Yeah. Okay, we got all those. Sorted. Oh. Ah, just the fact that we're picking through bodies in the sewers. Ah. Oh, look, a phase
the glory of hell! It's amazing how useful that freedom of motion is on that two-handed sword. Ay -ay -ay. Sadly, you just get to wait for the paralysis to wear off. It's it's how it works in this. Lasts until it, the timer expires, so. Okay. You rang. I'm on it. All right, let's come back here. Start here. Uh, finish off these couple of intersections that goes elsewhere start here come back this way okay no I don't want you to up front Trying to be rude, but you know what, Imon? You're not someone I want to be <laughs> leading the party. You're a bit squishy. Cistern is the word. These are cisterns. Couldn't remember the name for them for a minute there. A lot of dark down in the sewers. And a lot of random <laughs> ways back up to the surface. Okay, let's do this one because 
it's pretty well just connecting here. And there we go. Uh, that'll be similar. Just a hallway that connects to another hallway. Mostly examined. We might have finally gotten through all the carrion crawlers down here. Maybe. Ends. This is a random room that's not letting us in. And we're somewhere. I'm on it. Could With the shop. Could we have a moment of your time? Okay, what is it? First, let me introduce the two of us. I'm Mark. This is my companion, Lothan Lothander. I thought it would be nice for you to know our names, because if you don't take our advice, you'll be seeing more of us too. I know you've been taking an active interest in destroying the Iron Throne. Don't try to deny me. My companion and I are in the aforementioned throne. We thought it would be polite to give you one last warning. Stop interfering with our employer's business. You can decide to disregard this warning, but if you do, it'll be the last decision you ever make. See you later. Gee, thanks for the warning. I mean, the fact that it's open is kind of... <laughs> Welcome to my humble establishment. Okay. Uh -huh. Wand of Polymorphic. Those are worth selling. Sell that. It's weird how hard it is to find people to identify stuff. I'm on it. Yeah, okay. 
that's where I thought we were. Sorted. Don't ask me. I, I don't know. I don't know who came up with that. But yeah, that's that's the sewers in this game. Sorted. Alright, let's talk about word. it. And now all things gone. Okay, we learned that an ogre mage holed up in the sewers was, was responsible for all the disappearances. He had several carrying crawlers that would steal out at night to carry off random victims. The crawlers used their hapless prey as food while the ogre mage took any valuables that might have. You've done a good job and earned your boldness in full. Do you have any of the items possessed by the ogre's victims? I'm sure their families would like to have something to remember their loved ones. We know for a fact that the Sash and Star family lost a daughter to those creatures. She had the signet ring, and a ring inset with the... Yes, we did. We'll have one in return. Thank you for your honesty. I'll throw in a 3,000 gold bonus... For the return of the items. Anyway, I'm going to need some people to do some investigating of the Iron Throne. I'm just going to finish up some paperwork then. I'll be just outside the main doors of the F Flaming Fist compound. If you wish to discuss the Iron Throne, just come talk to me there. I'm on it. Okay, who are you? Yo, he acts would speak at you. But tis destined to be so. Thou wouldst presume to speak to Tex the Great? Thy bravery is oddly tempered with foolishness. Still, Sarek has decreed that I seek out the services of one such as thyself. Tex himself, myself, will aid in your quest. In return, when the time is right, you'll, your might will forge the way for my ascension to power. Do you accept this honor? Okay. I rather think not. <laughs> you demented little man. What? Fate decrees the world to thine hands, and you flout her as a common wench? Are ye cup shot? Mutton headed fool, you and your natty lads will be fallen away from a horse load to a cart load, whilst TX puts the world to bed with a shovel? will be a squeak for your life then ye duke of limbs stir your stumps and be gone okay I mean in all honesty if you want to deal with the god of lies be ready for whatever comes your way Okay. Oh. Excuse me. We need to actually move on to Bar go back to Paragos and sell off some bandit scalps.
Fair ghost. You have been waylaid by enemies. Oh wow. Sorted. Why was yours Go the on, last man. to die? I'm on it. Great peril yields great beauty. Sorted. Well, there's one thing. We never had problems with arrows in this game. Since... Oh. I'm on it. If we want to go here, we might as well just go here. see if we can find an angel skin ring because we have sold a lot well here and at the blacksmith and you're going to get in that little hole that you always get stuck in because it's the fastest way except for it doesn't go through Sorted. Can I assist you? Show me your list of so oh. Oh look, everyone's finally fully healed up. I'm on it. can make whatever you oh, wish what for you a wee for sale, bit man. more than the competition. Let's see, do you got an angel skin ring? The answer is no, he does not.
Bolt of Lightning. Worth 600 to sell all of them, so we'll go with that. Took me this long to find a plus one slate, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh. I can make whatever you wish for a wee little bit more than me competition. Sorted. Oop. It's like, Imon, please come back. <laughs> You're a queer fellow. I've done had enough of this. You rang. I'm on it. Sorted. that one. Oh. It's just north of me. Oh. Sorted. I don't think I came here very often. You want the whiskey? Offer nothing. Get spelled post in. Right, what's this then? Sorted. Well, let's see. Sorted. Okay, well, right, what's this then? I want to go here. Governor, 
We don't need to talk to you right now, Scar. Sorted. Ah, a ring of angel skin. You must know my lady well to have chosen so appropriately. If you're ever needing a little work around here, check with Scar, second in command of the Flaming Fist. You can tell him I recommended you. another job for you. This one involves a group you have dealt with in the past, the Iron Throne. Duke Eltham himself wishes to speak to you about this. Will you come with me? Of course we'll come, especially if we have an alliance audience with the Grand Duke. Just follow me. I'll take you to the Flaming Fist compound. The Grand Duke is waiting for us. I am a man of my word. Let me introduce you to Grand Duke Elton, one of the Lords of the City, Commander of the Flaming Fist, and member of the Lord's Alliance. <coughs> I'm glad to see that you come. I know that such a meeting is unusual, but in these circumstances it is necessary. I would first ask what involvement you have had with the merchant society known as the Iron Throne. We have learned they are involved in a plot that threatens the stability of your city. From what I have been told, you have been quite a thorn in the side of the Iron Throne. I am interested in you because of the obvious hatred that they hold for you. Their recent activities have been brought to my attention, and I am very dubious about the intent of the throne. I think it is far too easy to blame the recent caravan raids and iron shortages on the Zentarum. Though the evidence does point to them, they do not have much to profit while the Iron Throne has everything to gain. I have much to concern me right now, especially with tension rising between our city and the nation of Alm. Unfortunately, my hands are tied. I can't act against the Iron Throne until I have hard evidence of their wrongdoing. That's, of course, where you come in. I need a small group of spies to break into the Iron Throne headquarters and see if they can find any proof of the Throne's involvement with the caravan raids. If you do this for me, you'll be paid extremely well. 2,000 gold to divide amongst yourself. What's your answer? We'd be honored. You have made a wise decision. It is a difficult mission that I give you, but I am sure you have the wherewithal to make it through. Return and report to me once you feel you have enough information to use against the go Iron Throne. Right, what's this then? The stair oh, there they are. Sorted. Okay. General yield in potion shop. Oh, there's a potion shop. That might be worth going to. See what they've got to sell. Maybe so. Oh, sell off some of the stuff we've got. Wow. I'm on it. Mm. 
Oh. Welcome to my humble establishment. Please browse and take your time. I have no wish to rest a potential new customer. Let's see what you have then. Hmm. Neutralize. <laughs> What's that? All forms of magical non physical damage. Uh, automatically successful. Uh, let's see. For three turns. Okay, well, General yield in. Right, what's this then? We might want to take. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that's what it is. Sorted. Sorted. Bartender explodes in a puff of green mist. It's like, ah. Uh. I'm on it. <laughs> There's the answer. 
Harbor Master, Water Queen's House, Flint Tavern, Warehouse, Warehouse, Little Lantern, well. Let's head here. Sorted. You want the whiskey? Who brought you to my event? Going to terror, let's see what you have to offer. I think we'll run a room quick. A lively place, but filled with vice. Sorted. Even the most prolific adventurer right, must take some okay, time to rest. Um. Please, I need to rest. Yeah, yeah okay, okay. I, I get it. For one day. I'm on it. I need the mail. You want the whiskey? Mm. I think we all deserve a pat on the back. Right, what's this then? Um, we get too involved in the Iron Throne and into the game. We are that close. Oh, yeah. Corner on. Sorcerer's Sundries, but... What about them? No time to chit chat. Out, away, fly while you can. There be madness here, and I can stand it no longer. Be malice here, I but madness. Calm down and explain yourself, good sir, that I may understand you better. Calm down, calm down, while Sir Vazaka likes to practice their magic cacophony above me. I dare not, stranger. I dare n say not at all. Sorted. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. It'll be. All my stuff is authentic. Really, it is. Hey, yeah. Uh. Who are you? Welcome to the Air Throne business. What business? Yes.
and we seek employment with the Iron Throne. If you could direct us to someone with whom we could speak, then we will be on our way. We don't need no men employees. Now get lost. Bloody? Really? I'm on it. Oh. The village of Old Gaspir lies on the banks of River Chathra, just up for the name from Baldur's Gate and the open sea beyond. This farm dotted countryside is usually a peaceful haven from the turmoil of the Sword Coast, although of late the same cannot be said of Old Gaspir itself. The simple fishing village has become the source of many rumors in recent days. Rumors of an ancient cult risen again, unsubstantiated details of murderous creatures stalking the night, and talk of strange going on in the house of Shendalar, the powerful and eccentric mage who makes his home in the normally sleepy village. You have also heard with certainty that tours of the fabled Durlag Tower operate from Old Gaspir, and that it is truly a place where adventurers can test their mettle. Perhaps such a test will better prepare you to fight the darkness that threatens to destroy the Sword Coast and you with it. Sorted. Your acquaintance I am glad to have made. You funny looking. Yours are bereft of any and all worth as meaningful men be treated as the dog they are. Ike. Step right up. Step right up. Well, at least Step it's a right good up. Step right up. Step right up, folks, and hear the tale of dread placed before thee. Join with me as I, adventure extraordinaire like Cascadian Vendar, lead yet another group of brave souls through the very seat of danger in the ray. To Durlag's Tower we shall go and witness the perils that have taken the lives of hundreds of courageous men and women. See the horror of the treacherous traps. Feel the presence of the long languishing dead. Marvel at the wondrous wealth buried below. Not for the weak of spirit as I will not be held accountable for any heart failures during or after our expedition. Step up, step up, one at a time. Ah, good people of noble blood who would throw down the gauntlet in the face of chance. Come see the lengths a man must go to to, interact, to protect what is his. A special package deal of 60 gold for your entire group. Not that you would need a discount. When are we to leave? That will fill my quota for this trip. We leave forthwith. Remember to kiss your loved ones goodbye, for you may never see them again. Meet me at the base of the tower. You would surely be killed without me, but fear not. Only I can enter where others fear to tread. Hergen would speak at you, uh, so listen yes. up a moment or two. Merry band of heroes you be, but I have a, I've got the adventure that'll make ye yearn for glory. 
I am Harn Stormblade. Stoneblade, presently residing in Citadel Adbar. Well met, what adventure do you speak of? A glorious adventure indeed. You have heard of Durlag's Tower, mayhap? I've heard it, yes. It's a haunted tower to the south of here, is it not? It was haunted by me granda's friend for a time. He went mad, you see. Durlag Troll Killer was a dwarven hero of great renown. Single handedly slew many a dragon he did. Me granda was a good friend of Durlag's. They adventured together until me granda's untimely death several centuries ago. Me granda was slain by an evil demon, but Durlag survived. Durlag kept Soul Taker that had been me granda's. He was going to send it to me mother, but he was betrayed. A sad tale, that. After Durlag built the tower, his family was replaced by doppelgangers. Durlag killed them all, but was driven mad by the act. He entrapped his tower heavily and forgot about me granddad's dagger. When I heard the story as a youth, I went to retrieve the dagger myself, but was driven back by Durlag's devious traps. If ye be interested, I wish to hire ye to retrieve me granddad's dagger. Soul Taker, me birthright. The tower has been penetrated somewhat by previous adventurers. I should think that the edge has been taken off the danger. What say you? I will find your dagger if I'm anywhere. Good fortune to ye then. I shall await your return here. Sorted. You want some whiskey? If you got good coin to spend, I can set up, up with whatever you need. I have all that an adventure may need. What can I get for the lot of you? That would depend on what you have to offer. What are you offering? Okay. Invisibility. Ring of Invisibility. Sand Thief String. Held by a master thief for the better part of a generation, this ring was put to bold use in the markets of Waterdeep. Working a crowd in broad daylight, the rogue would steal countless numbers of persons from nobles, replacing them with bags of sand so the theft would go unnoticed. His identity was never known, but the name Sand Thief was cursed loudly in its stead. It is rumored he retired and now lives among the nobles he used to rob. <laughs> huh. mm -hmm. Oh, gee, got arrows and arrows and arrows. Hey, how'd you like to be supping on fine venison and tipping back the good stuff? I have the key to a wealth legendary if you're up for it. Hear me out and the rest of these sods will be tugging on your coattails for loose coppers someday. Tell me more, good sir. Ah, you've an adventurous spirit in you. No doubt you've heard of the labyrinth of Durlag's Tower, eh? And how she's been pillaged so often that fat nobles go there for picnics. Well, the tower has, but the low. Tower has, but the low are dungeons untouched. I have a token, a war token to be sure, that gives entry to them. Tis yours, 
if you'll but settle my tab so I can leave this fine place with all my limbs intact. Tact. How much of this tab is the stake? Tab is the stake. Here's some. I'm embarrassed. I cannot cover it myself. 900 gold and I'm off the hook. What say you? Where did the likes of you get this? Like all things, it had an owner before me who does not have it now. Tis none of your affair what occurred in between. Shall you own it next or no? Oh, I have no... Oh. I'll have no part of your stolen goods. Ah, cowards all still. I'll be here begging for more time if you change your mind. Sorted. I know of you. You are an odd countenance, and I can count pretty darn high, too. I have need of you. What say you to this? I don't know who you are. Introduce yourself, and we shall see if I can help you. I am Chandelar, and I am the default benefactor of this place. My home is here, as are my major interests. I take interest in whoever comes this way, and you are very interesting indeed. I should like you to perform a task for me. Small thing, really, but something I do not have time for myself. I need for you to go to another place and retrieve an item of mine. Very simple, and if you succeed, I think I will think all the better. What say you? Why do you need me for this task when you seem more than capable? Of other things that call my attention, so it is more convenient that you go. Besides, I know you not, and this serves a good measure of you. Already I know you are more interested in the why and not so much as the problem. Will you do this? Uh, yeah, I will. You are on your way then. When you have located my coat, return to where you arrived and this ward token will affect your relief or your passage back. Off you go now. Right, what's this then? Oh, he stuck us on an island. Tiny island. Okay. And whatever else it is, it's apparently go dig through this cave. Right, what's this then?
dying. Right, what's this then? Go on then. <laughs> You're a fifth way. Okay, come on. Let's see if we can find some traps. Sorted. Okay, well, well, well. I sense the ripples, and there you are. But you are something new. Tell me, friend, how come you the, to this place? Return. Probably the same way you did. Why don't you tell me your story and see if it's the same as mine? We are just the latest teleporting fools to be captured. This place seems to be a magnet of sorts. If you are powerful enough to transport without error across the ocean, you are apparently of sufficient power to be caught and dragged here. It is the very place that does it. Seems to ensure the energy and snare the energy. Needless to say, leaving the island by magical means seems entirely impossible. You will get used to seabird eggs if you wish to survive. You've taken the role of the island greeters? I think not. What is there? Who constructed it? such a place? What is its purpose? I don't know an answer to either question. Could be a joke of the gods or a test or both. <coughs> it is hard to tell with gods. It could be a natural phenomena, though these tunnels certainly are not. Trap mages may have fashioned them for shelter, however. There is little else to do here except plot, study, or go mad. I prefer to plot. On that note, if you would be so kind as to strip down and give me what you are carrying, I would be ever so gay. If you are, want my equipment, you're going to have to take it. Certainly. First you, then the other here. I need all the power I can get, and I don't mind taking it by force. much going on. Alright. Load that one because <laughs> Right, what's this then? Right, what's this then? 
well, we got here. Constructed it, what is my honor is my Okay, come on. Well, <laughs> sorted. Again, yeah, let's give you the sword. Okay, spit it out. I'm on it. My yeah, you rang sorted. Could use a little patching up. Hell as you will. My blade will cut you down to thigh. Okay. Spit it out. Right, what's this then? Honor. Yeah. Hi. Okay. You rang. Right, what's this then? I'm on it. Hi. You know what? Let, let's just try an old fashioned. Yep. Easy to go away. Consider it done. this head. Hello, sure thing.
rang. Oh, you dumbass. Mm -hmm. Hi. All right. Yeah, we're still going to try and do this. You betcha. this then? Yep. Consider it done. Buddy, you're just getting us killed, thanks. Spit it out, salt it. Stop walking down the hallway, you moron! Right, what's this then? Hi! Yep, yep, yep. I know we need to keep everyone alive. Right, what's this then? Please, whatever you do, don't go to where I tell you to go to. These things, pick them up. I don't feel like it. Alright, well, since we know that's going to be a difficult, painful battle... We're going to stop there, and we're going to come back to this next time. Uh, and Have a great day, and join us for some more Starfinder tonight.